Nice shirt. That one's more to my taste. Why, thank you. I thought it was kind of appropriate. I'd like to cut through some political <laughs> with chainsaws. Rev them up, bitches. This was an inappropriate shirt for probably the way a lot of people are feeling. True that. Everybody's like feeling something. Constipation here, nausea there. It's a crazy time of the world right now. So, how do you tell the sides apart? They each have their symbols. Who's the ass? Okay, that's not nice. It's a donkey. Donkey, jackass, donkey. Same thing. Okay, that's the Democrats. And the Republicans are the elephant. Who thought up those symbols? I don't know. That's just how it ended up. Why not the snakes and the sharks? That's something for us to Google and research. You Google, I'm moving on. Maybe the symbols should be changed. I agree. It maybe should be switched, but hey. Whoa, who's the non-smiling pretty lady? Oh, that's the, that's the wife. When is the first dog coming on? I don't think there is a first dog. No dog, no Bailey. Well, you don't have to be all upset about it. I don't think they have any pets. Uh, well, that's just downright unconstitutional. What's wrong with them? Lots of people have first pets. With President Obama, we had Sonny, a Portuguese water hound. And then there was the Bush's dog, Mrs. Beasley, the Scottish Terrier, your grandmother loved because Scotties are her favorite. What the hell? Well, don't take offense. She's learned to love corgis now. You don't need to learn to love us. We are just inherently lovable. And then before that, when the Clintons were in office. Ugh, stinking cat. I mean, he was black and white like you. That's racial profiling based on fur. Not cool. His name was Socks. You can't like be too upset about that. And he was in the White House. I want a dog running for president, then I'd be more interested. Then who would you vote for for the dog's president? Easy, my friend Zoe for president, and my friend Sadie for vice president, Ooh, and my friend Paco for speaker of everything. Dude's got mad swagger. How much longer am I stuck watching this with you? Just two more nights. You can hang in there. You know, we got through last week. Barely. Listen to the Democrats. Who's up tonight? And last night it was the older son and the girlfriend. My ears are still ringing a week later. Okay, I'm sorry your ears are still ringing, but I'm sure you'll be fine. So tonight they have the youngest son and a daughter and his wife. What the hell is this? Keeping up with the Kardashians? Ooh, can we watch that instead? Okay, that was funny. Not sure if you heard, it's been canceled. I'm sure it's still on somewhere. I wish politics were canceled. Kind of feel you there. Okay, well, I'm out. Okay, I totally understand and get it, so see you tomorrow. If I must. Wait a sec, you still have the remote. I can't change it to the Kardashians. If you're enjoying Stacy and the Corgis, then click that subscribe button and hit that notification bell. Don't miss one video. And hit the like button and leave us a comment. We love hearing from you.